As we look at our full storm tracker forecast this Monday, starting the work week with a beautiful day. Beautiful mm. day. And Cap, those are some really big lightning bugs behind. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. These are no. These are the, these are the Perseid meteors, and this is really a cool perspective. You know, I always say. Um, if you sit out in a dark location, and I've done this many, many times for many years, if I see four or five in an hour, I, I feel lucky. Now, what Kurt Ruppel has done, this is a, a composite image. He did 600 pictures at 15 second intervals pointed at this section of the sky, and that's what he ended up with. I think we counted uh, 14 meteors and you get the trail because it's kind of like a time time lapse great picture and i just want to say you know first night back from vacation you got to kind of slowly ease in and i'll tell you we went out with a bang last night on vacation lisa and i went up uh, to spac met up with lydia and irene we had a great time uh, overlooking the crowd and you know, we, we went down to our seats and we wanted to come back, but there were so many people there. I mean, physically, it was hard to move around. The music was unbelievable. Those of you that are Zach Brown fans will get this. There was colder weather last night. That's one of our favorites, no doubt. Beautiful night to be at SPAC. 83 in Albany, 77 at Glens Falls, 74 in Cobleskill, upper 70s through Bennington County. 80 at North Adams, Great Barrington at 78. Checking in with our News 10 weather watchers, 77, Queensbury. Jim Delahanty in Hebron, 77. Low 70s right now, Indian Lake. And from uh, Kathy Buxton in uh, Long Lake, it's uh, 72. Out to the west of Albany. Gloversville, beautiful day, 77. Hessville at 75. Dwaynesburg, 73. Jim Glockner in Greenfield Center, 81. You head down to Waterford, 83. 75 up on the hill in Grafton from John Collin. Bennington, 78. Uh, 76 at uh, Pittsfield. And in Adams tonight, Sandy Shellhorn, 73 in Wyndham. Still close to 80 at Germantown. So here we go again. Rain coming into Pennsylvania and west of the Finger Lakes tonight. A storm coming out of Ohio is going to take that track uh, just to the south of us. We'll have a cooler northeast flow around that storm tomorrow. Pretty good dose of rain first part of the morning. This kind of upper level feature is going to rotate down over us uh, tomorrow afternoon. So we got to get rid of that. Here's our future cast. Rain will be close to us 10, 11, 12 o'clock tonight. Moving on through heaviest rains, capital region south. It'll be lighter as you head up towards uh, Lake George. Lingering showers during the afternoon. Again, that's storminess to the south of us. So Wednesday, we may start out kind of cloudy, then skies brightening up. Uh, can't rule out a shower or two during uh, the afternoon. 75 tomorrow in Albany, Bennington, Pittsfields, Glens Falls at uh, 75, 74 in Gloversville. Wednesday with a bit of sunshine, we're going to bounce back up with temperatures reaching the low 80s for much of the uh, Hudson Valley. Tonight, rain comes in late this evening, a low near 65. Periods of rain tomorrow, tapering to a few showers afternoon or evening, a high near 75. On Wednesday, a mix of clouds and sun. Can't rule out a few showers, 82. Partly sunny, chance of a shower Thursday, but mostly dry, 86. On Friday, breezy, scattered showers, not a washout, 78. Looks like a pretty good weekend. 77 Saturday, partly sunny, 87 on Sunday. And nice weather Monday, pleasant, a high of 83. Lydia? Thank you.